relating to increasing dog licensing fees. What's, I have no speakers, what's pleasure to board? Madam Chair. Supervisor Miller. Um, I was wondering if we could have some consideration for the police dogs, the canine dogs that the uh, Sheriff's Department officers take in, Georgia. and if we could reduce their fees to zero, because they take those dogs and they're the only ones that can take the dogs, the handlers, and uh, I, I've heard from them, and they're very concerned uh, of the cost of having to license them. So I didn't know if that would be a possibility. Mr. Huckle there. Madam Chair and Supervisor Miller, I think we would consider that the uh, cost of um, their employment, you know, therefore the, the county would pay those fees. Okay, because right now they have to pay them to uh, license them. And really? Yes, they have to pay them. Yeah, that. yeah and they have to pay the- When they retire. Yeah. Pardon? When they retire. When they retire, yeah, when they minute. retire the dogs yeah, when they you actually identify yourself and speak yeah. on the record if you want to speak to someone on the day as Miss Davis. I'm sorry, um, I'm Jean Davis, I'm Supervisor Miller, Chief of Staff. I was just clarifying that um, the when the canine dogs retire um, and the sheriff deputies handlers take them, they adopt them themselves. Uh, my understanding, and I think what Supervisor Miller was saying while I was clarifying, was that they do have to. Uh, Pay for their licensing once those dogs are retired from the sheriff's department. Yeah, so the dogs are actually retired and they take them. So I, I just wanted to see if we could put that in there. Yeah. Uh, this is still something that we should take care of. Yeah. Yeah. This is not a problem. Um, I would we, make that a part of my direction. Well, to do we? Let me ask real quick. Okay, sure. If we make that part of the motion, That's do we have to re-advertise the ordinance? I think it's a minute change. It's very few dogs yeah. we're talking about. Yeah, Madam Chair, we'll just assume that as direction to staff. Okay. Independent of the ordinance. Okay. Very good. Then I'll go ahead and move item 23, including ordinance number 2015-22. So, motion and a second. Any further discussion? Any objections? Yeah, close the public here. I'm sorry, close the public here. Forgot. Thank you. You're the only one awake at the moment on the dais. Uh, okay, uh, if there are no objections, motion carries unanimously. No.